Hello, welcome to my channel. I'm the Convalescing Soul. Welcome one, welcome all. I'm so grateful that you are here joining me today for another reading from the Hero's Journey Dream Oracle. And we are on number 49. Introduces to a 13. Did I ever figure out that then does the, that reduce to a 4? I don't know. Reduces to a 13 anyways. Afterglow. <clears throat> oh, wait a minute. Wait a Okay, no, there's no nudity I have to worry about. Looks like there might be, but there's not. <laughs> Land gracefully. That's sometimes difficult to do. When I was young, like in elementary school, I did gymnastics, and the thing was always about, like, sticking your land, like, whatever you were doing right. <laughs> you want your land, the landing, to stick. This one says land gracefully, which I think is very important. He's flying. Reminds me of dreams when I would fly. Hmm. Okay. Howard Thurman says, Keep fresh before me the moments of my high resolve that in fair weather or in foul, in good times or in tempest, in the days when the darkness and the foe are nameless or familiar, I may not forget that to which my life is committed. Keep fresh before me the moments of my high resolve. Okay. Here is the message. Coming home with the elixir after a soul-altering experience requires consciousness, attention, and care. You've been changed. Yet the, yet the world you're returning to has remained much the same. Like an airplane, Coming in for a landing, having sailed over oceans, deserts, and forests. If the pilot brings consciousness to the landing, it can be graceful, even though the craft is hitting solid asphalt. Returning home from a powerful inner and or outer journey may seem like the time to let go, but this stage takes as much consciousness as the rest. To make your re-entry smooth as possible, go out of your way to be gentle with yourself as you integrate slowly back to the ordinary world. Your dream symbol is that of flight. <clears throat> Dreams of flying suggest a liberation from your earthbound perspective, identity, and affairs. You've released the ego's gravitational hold and have been reunited with your higher, more expansive nature. You are now aware that you are part of a much larger tapestry of life. When you come back down to earth, allow your light to speak for itself. Let it tell the tale of your journey to remind others that there is more than this. Here is your mantra. I am a citizen of both heaven and earth. I soar high and land with grace. <laughs> well, no matter what you do today, may you land gracefully. <laughs> Have you ever been on those flights where um, you think you're going to die with the landing like it's so rough? <laughs> Beginner pilots, huh? <laughs> it's surprising because I thought most airplanes are so automated now that, that most landings should be graceful. Not always the case. <laughs> Alrighty, much love and many blessings.